Okay. A little on the rich side. Okay, now we're adjusting the valves, and when I say we, I mean Chris. McGilla Gorilla tightened all the valve adjusters like a big dog. That's why my yeah. That's why my screen name is Big Phil. <laughs> <laughs> okay, bumper over there, Sean. Good. Again. Good. Ooh, loose. Where loose? Let's take a look at this right here. And there is Big Phil, not normal Phil, Big Phil, putting the motor back together after, after a little valve adjustment action, see if we can quiet it down some. You know you call that secret tuning. That's right, that's after right. After some secret tuning. There's Tim Shorn, Turbo Dotson Meister. Okay. Phil. Okay. Okay. A little custom head work is what There's my way too expensive new turbo motor. Let's see. Uh, TO4R, 60-1 compressor housing, uh, Turbonetics race gate, inch and a half screamer pipe, way, way too much head work, custom ground ISKI cam, Ross forge pistons. It's uh, too, too, too expensive. Kids at home, don't ever build one of these. It's way too much money. Goodbye. Philip Smith, tuning. Turbo motor tuning expert. Punching in the numbers. Oh, I tune better when I'm drunk. Mm. <laughs> Here is everybody on Hybrid Z. There's uh, the fuel map. We are making some tweaks to the Pink's map that obviously had a fully worked built head with a very much bigger cam than what we're dealing with. So uh, we've been slowly uh, leaning out the fuel map and uh, smoothing out some of the big lumps that were in it uh, with the wideband. So. Uh, so far, so good. If if we had some decent weather here in Texas, it's like freezing rain. Uh, maniac Phil driving the car. So uh, so far, and and we're taking kind of a uh, a real conservative approach to tuning everything. Uh, we've got under boost fuel maps to about 11 and a half to one. The car's driving around at about 13 and a half to one. So uh, considering the weather and the fact that we've had the we should have had studded snow tires on the car. We, we've made some some pretty good uh, some pretty good progress, I think. We, we've done okay, and uh, uh, once we get some decent weather and we can tune it, uh, some high boost pulls at high RPM on you know on the highway, uh, I think everything will be groovy. Uh, 
do a run where it's breaking the ice off the windshield. That's right, because it is, it is Tommy White Man Speak 'em Truth. It is freaking. <laughs> It is freaking, dude, it is freaking nasty outside, you know. It is nasty. This is uh, outside of my shop, and it is, like, freezing rain. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I don't know if you can see, but check out this tree that has all kinds of freaking ice crystals forming on it and just crazy. Uh, also, a little tour of my Dotson Geek shop. Uh... I've always lived in the burbs, so when we moved here about a year ago, I had the shop built, and uh, it's 35 by 30, two Z cars, so that's my car, my my bitchin' car, uh, they'll, they'll fit in here pretty much nose to tail, uh, got all kinds of Z car parts everywhere, I've, I've got a spare Tommy if anybody's looking for one, there's my beautiful, wonderful wife, uh, Z car motors, there's a triple Weber. uh, High compression motor in the background, some uh, crankshafts, transmissions, blah, blah, blah. Phil is tuckered from tuning. All tuckered out. Tuning's hard work. That's right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Phil, your breath's so bad I can see it. Oh. Anyway, we're kind of shooting up some footage. You got that all filled in like it ought to be now? I got it filled in. Now I'm on the spark. Oh, okay. All right. Well, uh, we're going to take a little video break and uh, we'll fill in the spark table. Well, I'm on my way home. We uh, we tuned the car yesterday, and uh, I'm driving home right now. The weather is terrible. It uh, rained, iced, roaches, you know, the, the bridges all iced over and everything. So we, we uh, tuned the car, you know, the best we could. We're going to plan another day to uh, uh, tune it when it's drier so we can make some, you know, flat out third gear runs, full boost, uh, you know, maybe then start turning the boost up. Uh, I've still got a little bit of boost creep with the, uh, with the hole set. So, uh, I ported the, uh, internal wastegate out, but I, I need to do it some more. But, uh, anyway, this is what I'm driving in. It's messy out there. Hope you guys enjoy the video. More tuning to come and uh, some uh, mega squirt uh, installation video type of stuff. I'm going over a bridge right now. Made it. See you later.